Hello, I am Nick, the Rat King of Rat King Moto, and today I'm gonna be dishing this gas tank. This is a terrible idea. <laughs> So as you can see, there's a really big dent here. Some people would try and pull these dents out, but they're really deep, and I actually want to indent them because I also think it looks cool. And it's pretty easy to do. You just need a hammer. This is the hammer I'm gonna be using. It's not actually the uh, perfect type of hammer. You'd want really like a plastic or something like a hammer like that. It would make it, you know, easier to make it smoother if you use a hammer like that. Some softer, more round thing. But I don't really care. I'm just gonna be making it look sick, at least in my opinion. Basically, you just start by hitting it with a hammer. So what I'm going to be trying to do is bridge this ridge here between these two dents. So I'm going to start at the edge, just sort of work in there. And you don't want to develop any folds. So I got a fold that's developing along right here. So I'm going to start hammering that in before it becomes like a crease, because that'd be really hard to get rid of and it would mess up the whole thing. So I got a crease that's here. I was just saying I was trying to avoid. It'll be all right, it's not too thin, not too sharp, so it's gonna be kind of hammering the sides of it in to make it start evening out. Whew, this crease is getting to be a problem here. I kind of like the way this paint is coming off. It's actually quite smooth here. It won't matter though, because it's all scratched up up there, but you know. So I'm starting to flatten that crease now. It was getting pretty bad as I was working these down. Uh, it was getting pretty sharp, which was concerning me a little bit, but I managed to get it a little better back here which means I'll be able to work that up and it'll slowly even it out. Oh yeah, I got that crease almost back where I want it. It'll probably show up at the end. There'll probably be some little stress marks on the metal there, but that should be okay. Getting it to look a lot better. I'm gonna need a vacuum after all this. There's just like so much of this like paint that's peeling off. I need to clean this area up pretty good when I'm done. What I'm trying to get this to be is so that when you're looking at it from the top down, there's an even line across like this way. I'm almost there. Just need to bring this back a little bit more. It's important not to get too carried away while hammering. You want to always check back every couple, you know, hits. Make sure it's still coming along the way you want it to. Woo! There we go. So I've got that line even at the bottom there, all the way up until it curves up. I could make that be a sharper point by using this end of the hammer and just sort of working that out and then evening the sides. I don't know if I'm going to do that. For now, I'm just going to make this crease more even there, which will also probably deepen this in this part. Alright, so I got this line pretty even along. So a few little bumps I'll be clearing up. And then I'm going to be working on to this point right here where it's just a little too sharp for what I want. So I'm going to be hammering this out so it's more round along right like there. All right, so I got this side how I want it to. This side I'm actually not going to dish right now because I have a couple ideas of what I want to be doing. Uh, but yeah, it's not very hard to do. This one was a little harder than usual because the dents in it were so severe, so deep. But it turned out all right anywho, so I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, if you start off with a side like this, a lot easier or if it has like a couple small dents in it, it makes it a heck of a lot easier to do but worked out pretty good and the sealant's all intact except for one tiny pinhole which happened 
because of where that crease was. So I'm gonna be welding that little thing up and then uh, smoothing it down. I'm pretty happy with that. I, uh, I'll get back with you guys later.